Richmond has an R&D team specifically uh, set up to look at uh, new innovations in coins. Um, coin, the coining world is not easy to come up with innovations. Um, we're dealing with precious metals, but um, our team takes it very seriously. In the, the last uh, three years, we've been looking very heavily into diamonds on coins. Um, we've done products that have sold for over a million dollars, uh, one-off gold kilo coins with large uh, pink tender stone diamonds. Uh, we've been doing a lot of work with rotating coins where we have an inset where it rotates uh, within the coin and the coins are actually antique so you can touch them which is unusual in the coin world where in general you don't touch coins too much. So they've been very popular with our audience as well. We've been inserting things like clocks, compasses um, and thermometers this year and it's proved very popular with our customers. Certainly in the American market, one of our most popular products has been the Wedgetail Legal Coin. Um, what's really significant about this coin is it's been designed by John McCanty, who was the uh, 12th Chief Engraver of the US Mint. And uh, we've had a partnership with John McCanty where he's designed um, three eagles for us, um, going back to 2014. Um, they've really uh, hit a, a really strong note with the US collectors. Um, they're getting an Australian wedge-tailed eagle, but of course done by this classic American designer who was so prominent for designing so many American eagle coins. Yes, yeah, certainly some of the new products we have on offer at the moment, um, we're doing a Pink Panther um, ingot. So basically we're doing a one ounce rose gold ingot and it's actually inset with Argyle pink diamonds. Pink diamonds are actually very rare, um, one of the rarest diamonds in the world. Uh, they come from the northwest of Western Australia and we've actually had a license agreement with MGM to do the Pink Panther so it's been a very popular product. We do it in a one ounce rose gold, a ten ounce rose gold and a one ounce platinum. Uh, one of the other products coming out um, very soon is actually a two ounce Pied Fort Wedgetail Eagle, again designed by John McCanty. We're very excited about that. We haven't done um, a lot of work in the Pied Ford area, which of course is a double thickness coin, um, double size. So it's a two ounce silver in a one ounce sizing uh, 40 mil uh, diameter. And again, really excited about that. With a low mintage of only 3,000 coins, which in the American market is very small. One of the other areas we're very focused in is licensed products where we're trying to, I guess, bring in new collectors into the, uh, the coin world. And some of the products we've been working on in the last 12 to 18 months have included Hot Wheels. We've actually done a one ounce silver coin for Hot Wheels 50th anniversary. And of course, Hot Wheels has a very large collector base. Uh, a bit like the coin world of people collecting um, cars that are in mint condition. And, and they have large resale values, so we actually are tapping into that collector market um, with the silver coin. Uh, we have an agreement with Warner Brothers, so we've been doing Looney Tunes coins, and we have other agreements in place with Planet of the Apes, so we kind of hit these nice cult, uh, strong follow products. Um, the other uh, licensed product we've had a lot of success with over the last three years has been Star Trek. Um, we've been released numerous coins in that area and they've been very successful, particularly again in the North American market where Star Trek's been so strong for so many years. And finally in September, um, look out for the Perth Mint's uh, very famous um, Lunar Calendar series. And this year it's the year of the pig. Um, our coins um, start releasing from September onwards and it's actually the final year of our second series. So we've now been doing this lunar series for 24 years. So it's two complete cycles. And next year we look forward to starting our third cycle in what's a much anticipated release for collectors and bullion buyers alike.